Hey guys, it's Rex from 3DayRespawn.com and I'm here once again with some more tips and tricks for one in the chamber, this time on the map jungle. And so we're going to start off here back in this corner here. Um, your starting spawn is really going to uh, dictate a lot of your strategy on this map. Um, because I started in kind of a main path here, I need to get to a place where my back can be a little bit covered um, by the wall. And uh, you'll see I just got owned with uh, in a little melee fight there and part of the reason for that is because I use the tactical uh, button layout on my controller which puts the melee button on my B button and uh, what the problem with that is that I cannot turn and melee at the same time without taking my thumb off of the stick. Um, now that I respawned over here I kinda lucked out that nobody was up here because um, coming up on this rock here is something that's incredibly handy uh, for a couple of reasons. First of all, I can see most of the map from up here. And I'm not going to take a shot at that guy if, I, if I'm if i not confident that I'm going to hit him, because if I miss, then he knows I'm up here, and then I'm kind of screwed because I've got no, uh, uh, no nowhere to go. I'm going to have to go out and try and knife somebody. Um, but one of the great parts of being up on this rock here is that I can watch this ladder. And before anyone can get on this ladder, they have to climb up onto the rock below the ladder. And when they do that, I can hear them. I can hear the little huh! that they make when they're climbing up on the rock. And you'll hear that here in just a minute. Um, but So that's going to alert me that a guy's coming up the ladder here. So in a minute, I'm going to move over to another position. But while I'm up here, I can... I, I know nobody's going to come up behind me because they're not going to be able to climb up that, that rock on the front side. And um, I can kind of watch the back. People kind of like to get up here, so it's a pretty good, it's a pretty good uh, place to watch for traffic. Um, so there's nothing going on here right now, so um, I can kind of move from the back part of the rock to the front part. You have to be real careful, though, out in the open. And here comes a guy. And there's the hoop that you heard. And, of course, I missed him, but luckily the dude's on the ladder, so he can't fire. So I was able to go up and knife him. Uh, but now I've got a great view from up here as well, and uh, like I said, I've got to be real careful when I'm up here. First of all, that I don't miss a shot because there's a lot of real long shots. Uh, but I don't want to miss a shot, and then I also am really exposed from all over. Um, fortunately, uh, most people are, are busy looking at what's in front of their face instead of checking out what's on top of the rock. Now this spot that I'm in right now, off to the side there, is a perfect spot because guys really can't see me. They, they can't tell that anybody's up here on that rock until they start climbing up that ladder. And when they're on the ladder, they're helpless. They can't, they can't do anything because they can't fire. Um, and once again, I have that little warning when they climb up onto that rock. And you'll hear that every time. You, so that's a, that's a kind of your early warning detection system that's uh, great to have while you're up here. And again, I've got my trident. Oh, once again, missed that guy. And I kind of lucked out there because I should have had it. But once again, I've got my uh, Triton uh, AX Pro headset, and so I can tell exactly where anybody is coming from when they're running, as long as they're not crouching, which they hardly ever do. And here I'm going to try and change things up again a bit, because the guy obviously knows where I'm at, and there's a spot where he probably should have had me as well, but he didn't. So I'm going to go back to the rock here. It's always a good go-to spot. And here I can see that he's on the little path straight across there, so we're going to get into a little bit of a battle. I like to play a little game with the radar here. I, I like to let him see me in one spot and then move real quick and then shoot him. But I'm going to pop up and see where he's at, and then I'm going to start strafing until my reticle's open right like that. And there you have it. There's some more uh, strategy for success on jungle in One in the Chamber. Hope you enjoyed it. Please visit our website at 3DayRespawn.com and subscribe to the videos for more.